Here are five Rube Goldberg machine hacks that will make you a better builder. Number one, having trouble making your machines very long because they keep running out of energy? Try building your machine on a table instead. That way, when your machine runs out of kinetic energy, simply put a domino with a string attached at the edge of the table. Connect the other end of the string to another part of the machine, and now you're good to go. You now have a full supply of potential energy, and you can keep building like a master. Number two, tired of searching forever for that one thing you need? Organizing your materials will really help. Put all your track, dominoes with string, ping pong balls, blocks, marbles, golf balls, connects, trains, train track, and dominoes in their own spot so you know where they are when you need them. Number three. Want to make your Rube Goldberg machines more interesting? Place a shoebox in the middle of your building area. This will force you to work on and around this new obstacle. The reason this works is because it adds the aspect of height to your machine. With this Rube Goldberg hack, you'll never have to worry about boring machines again. Number four. Is it taking forever to reset your machine when it fails? That's probably because you are using too many dominoes. Dominoes are boring, so only use them if you must. Besides, they are tedious to reset, and they can be unpredictable. If you must use dominoes, use pivot tracks. They are still boring, but at least they are easy to reset, and they will always fall in the same way. If you do this, you'll feel like a Rube Goldberg machine hero. Number five. Want to make your machines more complicated? Don't build your machines linearly. Instead of having a chain of events where one event leads to another, which leads to another, etc., Try building a machine that overlaps itself, and has one part that is used multiple times, or in multiple different ways. Have a track that a ball rolls over twice, or a track that moves to a different place, or a zigzag board with two different paths. If you use this hack, you'll be a Rube Goldberg machine genius. So there you go, five Rube Goldberg machine hacks that you can start using right now. In case you didn't notice, I have taken the original machine I had on the floor in the beginning, and throughout the video, I modified it using my five Rube Goldberg machine hacks, and this is what we ended up with. This is what I want you to do too. Build your own machine, and then modify it using these hacks. I promise you'll end up with something so much better than what you started with. Now this video was actually a collaboration with expert domino builder Crazy Pants Domino Child. So, if you're more into dominoes, go check out his video, 5 Domino Hacks, right here.